The most important thing for cloning is DNA. So before we get to cloning, we must extract DNA. I could use my hair, but the hair on my comb is dead and the DNA has broken up. It's good for getting a look at my ancestry and potential health problems, but it won't do for cloning. Plucking it would get the root, which is fine, but it still hurts. Fortunately, I know a painless method of DNA extraction. I've undergone this procedure three times and it's safe and easy enough to do it in your own home. Here's what you will need. Three clear glasses, table salt, dish soap, rubbing alcohol, and bottle of water. You get 250 milliliters of the water and 1.5 teaspoons of table salt. You mix the salt in the water until it dissolves. Then you gargle the solution for a minute. So after you're done gargling, you spit it out into the cup and you add a drop of dish soap. And then you mix that. But you have to be careful when you're mixing because you don't want any bubbles. And next, after that, you get 100 milliliters of the rubbing alcohol. And you pour it into the dish soap. So you gotta tilt the, the salty soap water so the alcohol forms a little layer on top. And then you wait two and a half minutes. I've used my sketchbook because it has a dark background so you can see the DNA form. What you are going to see when your DNA is extracted is these little wispy clouds or strands.